Hi, welcome to Totally Random. So, uh, on the topic of lever tumble locks, uh, this is a book on the in, uh, impressioning, uh, how to fit keys by impressioning in particular. Uh, so it deals with lever locks. However, um, just a bit of progress on this old vintage padlock I've got. Uh, made a key, well, part of a key impressioned it today. So it, you can see that it'll turn to about 10 o'clock and totally massacred a screwdriver trying to get tension on it and it'll turn back to about 1am or however you count the hours and these are some blanks so the idea with these is that whichever end ends up with the cut on the, that successfully opens the lock this piece here will get trimmed off we'll get some piece of brass in there so we have a working key so this is a good friend of mine's lock that he has had for well over 20 years um, and it was buried in a bottle dump uh, which is quite interesting he's given a bit of attention to it over the years and sort of kept it in decent nick but yeah this was literally buried for some time and we believe the shackle well not the shackle but the cover was down at the time uh, hence why it didn't rust out inside however oh, and I've moved it now there was a pile of rust and garbage that has come out of it and quite a, a fair bit has come out of it so you need to get in a successful impression of this uh, however, if you've impressioned these before, give us a yell, because it'll be interesting to, interested to hear what you have to say. Uh, if this looks weird, it's because eventually that piece will be removed, and whichever end is impressioned well enough to open the lock, that will uh, be the side I keep. Uh, I've seen curtain, brass curtain rod rings soldered into the back of them so yeah that's just a bit of progress with this uh, lock so that's what I've got so far it's only going you know, to about 11 o'clock down to about 1 o'clock on the other side all I can imagine is that I have filed off either too much material or too little on this side so it's had a bit of wood smell and a bit of vast uh, solder on just to hold it together. However, that looks like a pretty basic key and I'm pretty sure that this is an old railroad lock because it was very close to a railway railway line um, where trains would be parked. So the theory is that it was discarded uh, and somehow ended up in the bottle dump area or at least was discarded prior to that and then <coughs> the bottle dump was put there and this was just when they cleared it all out to put a new building there this was still intact one of the problems I'm having with it is that the shackle here there's quite a bit of rust around the bottom of it so I'm not sure whether this is a key that would open it and we've just got rust up here or not so if you have any thoughts of that in particular um, please feel free to leave them in the comments um, yeah be interested to hear your ideas totally random thanks for watching